Jerry, NTSA has come up with so many campaigns to help with road safety. If you can just tell us what are some of the campaigns to educate us? We, you're right, Ashley, we do have various campaigns, both education and also enforcement campaigns to ensure that um, road users are complying. Yeah. Changing road user behavior, changing anybody's behavior mm. is a humongous task yeah. and it takes time. But through our campaigns, we are beginning to see some change taking place. Um, as we speak, we've seen a reduction of 4.3% of fatalities from the same period last year. So we know we are heading in the right direction. We would like to see um, us moving, making progress f a lot faster than that, but at least we're heading in the right direction. Some of the campaigns that we have um, are about partnership working because road safety is not just about NTSA. We are the state agency who leads um, this road safety agenda, but we cannot do this alone. And our key partners are those road users, the National Police Service, and even the private sector, as well as other state agencies. So we continue to partner with them. One of our most successful campaigns has been our NTSA application, which I hope you have downloaded <laughs> on your phone, Ashley. No, I well haven't. As <laughs> it is a free app. Yes, Please go yes, to I Google have. Store and yeah. download it. Yeah. You're even able to check your own driver's license, ensure that your license um, is on the system, then that it is valid. You may find that it is not. Mm -hmm. And it's a powerful tool that we're giving passengers PSV passengers this Christmas, download the app and before you get on a PSV, you can verify that that PSV is properly licensed, it is a roadworthy vehicle because it has a motor vehicle inspection, you can even check the driver's license and that empowers passengers to be able to make safe decisions. We all know about PSVs, there was a time in this country when PSVs were a menace and as you just mentioned Ashley, mm. that private cars are leading in causing deaths oh. and that the PSVs are a, a bit further down. They are not the leading cause. And it's because of the regulation that we have been able to enforce and the compliance. And that is a huge success for us. Yeah. Um, and if we can continue doing that successfully and even do the same with um, the commercial vehicles and motorcycles and private vehicles, then there's no reason why we cannot be seeing that figure going down yeah. a lot more drastically. So what lessons can we learn from